in this video, I'm going to show you how to add number rows above alphabets in keyboard and iPhone. So if you head over to your settings, there's actually no option to do that. So you can do that on your iPhone. So I'm going to show you an alternative for that. So what we're going to do is we're going to be using an external keyboard. We are going to make use of an external keyboard that supports that. So just head over to your app store and there are a lot of keyboard that you can download. So the one I've tried that is working perfectly is Luxury Keyboard. So this is not a promotion video or anything. So just download any keyboard of your choice or make use of this one that I'm using. So you can just download any keyboard that supports it on your app store. So you need to install it. So I have installed this one already. So let me click on open. So when I click on open, it's going to take a few times to open. They are going to tell me to enable the keyboard. So go to settings. Let me show you how to do that. So open your settings application and you need to scroll down to general. After that, click on keyboard and you need to select keyboards at the top. After that, click on add new keyboard. Once you click add new keyboard, you're going to see a third party keyboard right here. Just click on that. So as you can see, we have enabled it successfully. Next, you're going to see set the keyboard. Just click on that. So you need to click on this icon if you want to switch. So you can switch from your iPhone keyboard to the luxury keyboard or, what or whatever keyboard you prefer. Just click on this and you need to set it. Once you have set it, you're going to see customize your keyboard. So click on that. And here you're going to see different things that you can customize. So let me customize the background only. You can customize the rest if you want. I don't like this gold at all. So let me look for a simple one. So in the simple, you're going to see a lot of design. And I think this design matched the original iPhone keyboard. So you're not going to see a lot of difference in it. So let's try to use this one. So I think if you want to enjoy this keyboard very well, you can just go for the premium. So let's go back. So you can just click on remove ads and go for the premium. So it's up to you if you want to go for the premium or you want to stay on the free app itself. So let's first make use of the free background. So let's head back to simple and we're going to make use of this one. Once you're done, click on back and you need to select set keyboard. Click on set keyboard. Now you can start using it. Now you can make use of the numbers at the top of our alphabet. Just try this out and you're going to see that it's an amazing app. You can also switch back to your original iPhone keyboard. Just tap on this and it's going to switch to your original iPhone keyboard. And that's it.